Yangu mwe bashira Yangu mwe bashira Chachine Yemwe mule tasha Kulireta on Lake Mweru in Zambia's northern Luapula province, fishermen are bringing in the day's catch. But for local people, a plentiful diet of fish has had unexpected consequences. A survey showed that 57% of blind people in Zambia come from Luapula province. The cause? Lack of vitamin A a lethal public health problem which also has a significant effect on child deaths as well as increasing the risk of women dying in childbirth. On the shores of Lake Mweru, Dr. Kunda runs a child health clinic serving the fishermen's families. People here regard fish as the only nutritious um, type of food. So they deprive the children um, other foodstuffs, um, giving priority to fish. Dietary supplements are so low. Most of the mothers uh, go for field work in the morning. They come back very late, so feeding is um, compromised. We usually detect that when there is diarrhea, and uh, when a p patient comes with um, eye problems, that's when we see that surely there is a vitamin A deficiency. The impact uh, of vitamin A deficiency, uh, it has uh, brought in high mortality and um, morbidity. We need to encourage these mothers to be giving their children vitamin A supplements. As you can see, if you look at the conjunctiva of the child, it's very, very red. You see? So measles also affects the eye. So it's very easy for these children, especially if they are malnourished, to get blind. In Zambia's capital, Lusaka, Freddy Mubanga is responsible for increasing vitamin A intake, both in Luapula province and throughout the whole country. Uh, we started investigating the micronutrient deficiencies in 1985, where we undertook a survey in one of the provinces, Luapula, which had recorded high levels of blindness. It was found that uh, about 16.2% of children 6 to 72 months had subclinical vitamin A deficiency. That, of course, gave a way to start thinking of some strategies to see how we can reduce the levels of uh, deficiencies. <laughs> Since the 1995 survey, Zambia has implemented vitamin supplements for children at child health clinics, both throughout the country and in the capital, Lusaka. George has got a very big catchment area and we see a lot of children. It's a really highly populated place. Yes, and it's a very busy clinic. We have a lot of underweights, malnourished children. We give vitamin A to the under fives. Alipalasti? <laughs> so I think for my baby to be healthy, I need to be coming here to get medicine for her to be protected from various diseases. Breastfeeding is the best. And it's cheap, <laughs> very cheap. You can buy vegetables, you eat. When the baby feeds, she gets all the nutrients. It's very cheap, in fact. I like it. in six months. Yes, they can get it through breastfeeding, yes. In case they don't get enough through the foods, then we supply.